Let's take a look at the Apogee ClipMic Digital version 2. Get it unboxed. Looks like someone may have already unboxed it previously. But it wasn't me. Okay, so yeah, kind of looks like that's going to be what's in the box. Uh, so you might be asking, why would I want a wired lav? Um, it's quite a few reasons, really. Um, as much as I love the Rode Wireless Go series, um, there's still the faff factor of like what I like about a wired lav is you can just plug it in and go. Um, but of course, with the iPhone 15's USB-C, the uh, clip mic digital version one uh, is basically basically obsolete, um, which is where this one comes in. So if we have a look at what we have in here, we have got the clip mic. So this is the analog to digital converter with oh micro USB, lovely. Um, that plastic feels a little bit cheaper than on the version one of the clip mic digital, which is what I'm actually recording my voice with at the moment. So obviously using a lightning device. Um, not sure what capsule they're using, um, but apparently it's 10 decibels uh, of self noise quieter than the previous, uh, the current the clip mic one, the current one I'm currently recording my voice with. Um, so if, I, if, I'm slight, if I'm silent and you hear the ambience and any noise floor, that will be, this is 10 decibels quieter and the maximum SPL is 127 decibels. So you can shout at this thing and the capsule itself is not gonna overload. I don't know what the, what the one I'm wearing, the clip mic one, don't know what the specs are there uh, but, but the you know the, the versatility of this version 2 is obviously we have all these different cable adapters and such going on let's have a look so we've got micro USB to USB C so obviously that is going to be good for the iPhone 15 and onwards. Uh, what's that? Oh, that's the windshield foam and the little steel cap. We have micro USB to lightning, which you know I can still use my previous iPhones, um, which is still lightning. Uh, and micro USB to USB A, so more like sort of your standard laptop and such. Um, so let's just get the clip mic digital two somewhat protected with his little steel cap. See that getting tugged and coming off and getting lost. Oh, actually, that does go on a bit more securely if you push down on it more. So that's a pretty standard um, looking setup. Uh, it's quite wide. Maybe that's an illusion because of how small the capsule is, because it's definitely smaller than the, the Clip Mic One, which I think was Sennheiser ME2 ME2 capsule on that. Um, the actual clip of the clip mic. So it's 360 swivel. So that'll just clip onto the actual wire, I guess. That 
that's that's pretty secure and then uh, I like to tuck tuck the wire down there and mount that way up so you don't get plosives going directly in if it's always pointing down and it's an omni obviously it doesn't matter that it's pointing down it's but it does matter because you if you get a plosive because it will go directly into the capsule but not if it's that way it won't uh, anyway so that's that and then uh, we want not that and uh, not that deal with that later so USB-C cable So USB-C endpoint and it's a real shame that it's not USB-C both ends. I guess micro USB is like cheaper. I don't know. There seems to be lots of audio manufacturers that just love micro USB for whatever reason. Maybe it gives the illusion of um, like being able to sell proprietary cables as you know something like a micro USB. USB-C it's probably not that common um, but of course you have to make sure you get things the right way up or you're going to mangle the connection and uh, that's that's actually yeah that's that's pretty secure it's pretty secure so yeah this is uh, Apogee product through and through now I think um, so on the original Clipmite Digital, they did provide the analog to digital converter, and Sennheiser basically provided the capsule. Now I don't know the source of this capsule, but clearly it's not it's not a Sennheiser branded at all. Now it's it's purely Apogee uh, professional lavalier microphone. Yeah, it certainly costs like one, <laughs> uh, but I do love the sound of like I mean I love the sound of the one I'm using at the moment but obviously with um, lightning on its way out it, it's you know this this is kind of future proof and the fact you can change the cables and such and so what I should be able to do is if I start a camera app on here so I don't know if you can read that so iPhone microphone front 48 kilohertz and then if we plug this in, we should see it figure out it's got a different microphone, if we're lucky. Let's plug that in so this is straight out of the box. Yep, there we go. Clip mic, clip mic, clip mic digital to 48 kilohertz. So that's, I like that. Let's just check the gain. So the gain, it's like maximum gain. Um, so I sort of place it next to the other one so this is just in roughly the same position as the one I'm recording with um, is clipping a bit so actually yeah, I didn't check my level so it's maybe quite a hot signal anyway um, so yeah, but you can adjust the gain down a little if needed um, and like I said I the, whoever makes this app can they please make that text bigger because if i didn't have macro mode i just cannot read that <laughs> not not and certainly not not quickly um, but somewhere in here somewhere in here we can set um preferred sound record oh, somewhere in here somewhere in here somewhere in here no, we don't want to take a photo. Our video codec file name or well, audio. Okay, so yeah, audio level. So sample rate. Is it going to let us select? No. So although the clip mic digital two is capable of ninety six kilohertz, um, the best it's going to do here, well, as we can see, is the 48 kilohertz which is still you know it's still decent and I don't know if it's down sampling from 24 bit into 16 bit but I'm pretty sure 
it ends up as a 16-bit recording on you know once it's embedded into the video file but that's where you know like a really decent analog to digital converter plays its part so yeah so i'm uh kind of looking forward to uh, doing my next recording with the uh, clip mic digital 2 on uh, a usb-c device probably my iphone 15.